Hey everyone, welcome to Legends of Podcasting. I'm Stu. I'm Ross. I'm Rob. And we're here for episode 7, season 1 of Ahsoka. The penultimate episode of this season. Already? Yeah, I know. Flown by, my friend. Flown by. So loads to loads to uh, still resolve as well. So I'm kind of curious how they're going to finish the season off. But um, they don't resolve it. No, it's going to be wide open, yeah. wide open. Um, but yes, last week we had the appearance of Thrawn and Ezra mm. show up, which uh, I was kind of expecting Thrawn. I don't know. I honestly didn't think they put Ezra in the in the show, but I'm really happy they did. So um, yeah, we have um, so we got Thrawn ship, which is, has a good a name that all the other reactors remember that we didn't. Chimera. Mm. That's the one. Yeah. I think it's yeah. all that. Like. And Chimera, the thing from Mission Puzzle 2. The yeah, virus. The virus. I think maybe it's the same thing. How is it you can remember that, but you can't remember the name? Because <laughs> I, I watched it the other day. Only because I watched it the, the other day. I know. You know me, man. I'm, I'm not good with any names. Any name. Anyone who's watched us for a long time knows Stu does not remember any names. He barely remembers his own. So, like, how many takes do you have to do this? How many takes we have to do this intro before I actually get my name right? It's ridiculous. Yeah. Um, the prompter in front of us where you start to put the yeah, question you kept calling me Stuart <laughs> exactly <laughs> it's just, yeah. Um, so, yeah, so yeah we had Th- uh, Thrawn with his <coughs> army of um, stormtroopers that sort of had like custom armour on yeah. like being fixed up a ship that is, looks very damaged mm-hmm. and then um, yeah working with the, uh, the witches and they looks like they were bringing things from the catacombs that looked very like coffin shaped yep mm-hmm. Space coffins full of dead people, yeah. presumably. So one of the prevailing theories about Marek, the one that Sabine, yeah. no, that Ahsoka killed on the mm. planet, yeah. is that it was a reanimated corpse with dark witch magic. Yes. So yes. presumably that's what's the rest of the going on with those yeah. bodies. Maybe it's a new army for Thrawn to control the galaxy with. Exactly. Yeah. Well, yeah, it makes sense because you're not going to do it without that. I mean, there's quite a lot of stormtroopers there, but not enough to take mm. over a galaxy. So mm. um, I guess he's going to need another army. So we have that. We also have then had um, them letting Sabine go to look around the planet introduced mm-hmm. to the sort of rock turtle men um, who, who Ezra's been hanging around with the whole time the um, Rebel, Rebel Alliance yeah, <laughs> yeah he's gone slowly <laughs> insane <laughs> over the years so, 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 someone, I can't remember if it was, it was on a reaction or someone commented I believe someone commented on our thing saying that it's quite, quite interesting that the witches can sense Ahsoka coming from another galaxy mm. they can't sense Ezra's on the planet mm. with them and have a trying to find him well I think they probably knew he was there they just don't care yeah well the thing is that they can sense that he's here but not pinpointed yeah do you know what I mean anyway like he's because the other thing as well when they said oh there's a Jedi and they blocked up Sabine yeah I still think they also think maybe Balin Balin yeah yeah, well. yeah. Well, say, the, other, the other interesting thing and the thing that I've really enjoyed in this show is Balin's story and him sort of talking to Chin when they were found the dead samurai yeah. raider bodies of him like I can sense a power here it's gonna, and it's going to break the cycle of light and dark yeah, it's like, so, so it's calling to me. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'm really curious to see what, what that is because it's such a shame, man. Because I honestly feel you could do it. He could have his own spin-off show. I don't know if they were writing him that way, but you could, you could easily, you could just pull, pull him and Chin out of the show, give them their own show. Yeah, it's a real shame that Ray passed away. Mm-hmm. Some being somewhat disrespectful, maybe you could, uh, you could do a Tales of the Jedi style animated version of him. Yeah, uh, which would require somebody to do his voice. Super, you know. Maybe yeah, yeah, well, if you do a real young version of it, maybe it could change it. But yeah, yeah. definitely, it's just it's such a cool character. I want to know more about him. So, Tales of the Jedi would be an awesome way to actually do it. It's a good, good idea. Maybe they will. Never know. Um, but yeah, I think that's pretty much it. And, and Ahsoka is still travelling through space on her way. <laughs> She's just going to get there as they turn around and fly back off again. Like, <laughs> yeah. God damn it! Yeah, <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. Yeah, potentially, potentially that could happen. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I don't know how long it takes them to get there. So um, they've got four days of putting. Lots of bodies apparently on the ship, so yeah. Three days, isn't it? Yeah, three. Three, yeah, I'm yeah. pretty sure it's three. More than one. Yeah, three days. Um, and and also uh, Sabine not telling Ezra how she got here mm. and what's going on. Which I think a lot of people were annoyed at, but I, I kind of get it. She's spent all this time finding him. She finally found him. She wants that moment of being mm. like, "You're alive." It's the fact that his last comment was, "So how are we getting off this rock?" And he's like, "Uh, <laughs> <laughs> <Is> that big <laughs> ship <laughs> that you uh, came here on. That's kind of how it's happened." Mm. Something someone's pointed out in the comments as well was um. Thrawn obviously doesn't like the Pergil any uh, at all due to what happened to him because it's the first thing he says like, oh if they're coming here with the whales shoot them down yeah, <laughs> just, yeah. shoot all the whales done with the whales yeah, yeah, they just... ruined my ship so um, but yeah I think that's pretty pretty much it so yeah I hope seeing what's going to happen this episode whether Thrawn makes it back to uh, to the Star Wars galaxy or that is maybe the cliffhanger at the end of the next episode but no it's, I think we should probably jump yeah, into this episode and find out and just before we jump into this episode of Ahsoka I want to thank everyone who's been subscribing to the channel over the past week we really 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 appreciate it 
But if you're watching this right now and you're still not subscribed, you found us due to this show and you're still umming and ahhing about subscribing, or you've been with us for ages and you still haven't subscribed, please, please, please click on that subscribe. The only way we can make this channel grow is with your help. So we really do appreciate every subscribe we get. So please click on that beautiful red button. Also, if you want to support us on Patreon, we have four watch alongs of this show as well as all the other shows we react to. So, link is in the description below. Head over to Patreon and sign up there. So, let's jump into this episode of Ahsoka. The Senate Oversight Committee is going to determine if your command should be permanently Don't, don't, don't focus on that this episode, I don't really don't care. <laughs> it's not the focus we should be worried about right now. Oh no, you can find more on the Great. My general of the New Republic Security. Chop it. Yeah. <laughs> He's down with us! He's a lawyer. <laughs> Have no problem bending to fit her. My job is to protect the people of this republic. And that is exactly what I was doing. In the Change best right way there. I know how. And you protected the new republic by ignoring direct orders. No, I protected the new republic by ignoring you. Ooh, you empire scum. <laughs> it reads like a child's fairy tale. Jedi. False Jedi. Star maps. Star whales. Distant galaxies. Honestly. Are we to believe any? There is no proof of any coordination between the scattered and dwindling number of Imperial forces. What about the conflict on Mandalore? <laughs> exactly my point. Gideon was a warlord acting on his own. There is no proof of a greater conspiracy and thus no immediate threat to this Republic. If Thrawn returns, that will change quickly. If? I don't know what frightens me more. The possibility of what might happen or your unwillingness to see it. Tell you what I he see. wants it to happen. I see a general who abuses her authority for personal gain, and I will not stand for it. Decision. I motion that General Sandula be court-martialed for disobeying a direct order. Oh, oh see, what? what? What's, what's Freepio doing here? I am Freepio. I've seen some shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, it's yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Senator Leia oh yes! She's throwing the way around now. <laughs> By all means. And wishes to present this data transcript, which she hopes may resolve the matter. Oh, is she going to be I sent Sindula? Therefore, she's asking my honours. Could be. In the scroll, Garner, personally sanctioned General Sindula's yeah. reconnaissance yeah. mission to Cetos. Covering <laughs> her back, love it. <laughs> Just a hologram of her middle finger. Yeah. <laughs> This is preposterous. The court cannot admit evidence of this kind from a mere droid. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> oh! oh. <laughs> His Senator, arms out oh, this. Job. Senator Organa <laughs> is willing to overlook this misstep, but asks that you address any further concerns to her directly in her role as leader of the Defense Council. <laughs> well, Mic drop. Yeah. Yeah. To settle the matter. Well, I love the way, like, just because he says it, that the rest of them, the rest of them said no, then he doesn't know that they just said Thanks, Lupio. Well, it is my programming and it's my pleasure to be of service, General Sindula. Did I have a word? Of course, Chancellor. I don't know what you and Leia are playing at, but I know she did not authorise your mission. She did. Eventually. <laughs> How real is the threat of Thrawn's return? Uh, very? That's why she did it? We have to prepare for the worst. I think I just chatted to Chopper in the background. Hey, hey, man, how you been? Let's see you around the poker game for ages. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's an anarchy. Yep. Fucking hologram. <laughs> the Clone Wars. <laughs> in this war, you will face more than just droids. <laughs> yeah, really making the most out of it. Even Count Dooku. You can face any one of them on the battlefield. As your master, it's my responsibility to prepare you. So practice these forms often. Or at least more than I can. <laughs> I won't always be there and look out for you. If we get separated or something happens, you need to be able to make it on your own. Don't be afraid. Remember what I taught you and trust your instincts. I know you can do this, Ahsoka. I fucking love Hayden Christensen so much. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's to see him again, that's amazing. He made 20 or more of these recordings. This was his last one. Oh. 
very thoughtful. I never realized that you are assuming the Star Whales have brought us to the correct galaxy, let alone the same <laughs> yeah, or even the same planet where Lady Ren was taken. I think the odds are pretty good. No, <laughs> no, in fact, they're terrible. Astronomically terrible. Now tell me the odds. I should have said something. <laughs> I did, but you never. <laughs> 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 Just him out the <laughs> We are exiting hyperspace now. Sweet. Straight to the sun. Yeah. Where the hell are we? I came here to die. <laughs> yeah, see, just going out on my terms. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, straight to see Red Dwarf fly past. Yeah. I'm picking up a lot of interference. Something's wrong. Uh, shot shot me, yeah, shut up. Ambush. Let's go. Oh, oh. oh it's so nice. Mines. Jesus. Fucking oh, hell, that's a lot of. How do they get these? Head towards the planet. The field eventually terminates. There are galaxy quests. Some dragon mines. <laughs> oh, okay. You have to say something. <laughs> The ring. Well, we found the enemy. Multiple <laughs> <laughs> uh, fighters are closing. I'm going to make for the debris field. I would not recommend that. Come on, where's that optimism? In another galaxy. Left it in my oven. No pants. I can't find an opening. The field is too dense. Just in the force. It would seem as if Adamo is alive and well after all. Here's everything the Inquisitorial database have on her. A master was General Anakin Yeah, Skywalker. no, that's the oh shit yes. moment. <laughs> Due respect, Grand Admiral. Without pursuit, we shall lose them in the debris field. You're quite right, of course. Jedi are very good at hiding. They've been practicing that for years. <laughs> And if she's anything like her master, she'll be unpredictable and quite dangerous. <laughs> Which is why we must control all variables. I will run a scan to see if I can locate Lady Ren. Yes, ma'am. A little. Thanks. <laughs> I never really thought about how much I've missed. I'm still trying to process everything you told me. There's a new Republic. Zeb's training recruits and Harris commanding commitment. Missed everything. Ahsoka took me on as her apprentice. <clears throat> she what? Why? I mean, you were shit. Go on. No, no. That's so I watched you with a lightsaber. <laughs> yeah. Of course. Yeah. So where is Ahsoka? Is she coming? She's dead. She, she's dead, doesn't she? It's complicated. Hmm. You see him or not? Yep. There they are. Oh, he's managed to get the raiders on his side. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Asuka Tano lies hidden within the graveyard. Find her? Yes, Grand Admiral. Triangulate. Yeah. So sleaze, what you call it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen that film in a long time. <laughs> Nothing. I cannot locate Lady Ren. Go the other way. Do you think your bond is that strong? Watch this. Yeah. The... Oh, I just I know really that. Great. Took me out when I really needed help. Set me up with this pod. Speed. Soka. I see her. Uh -oh. The Jedi is there. <laughs> 
something happens, I don't know. I don't know. Feeling. They found us. Don't worry. I know where we're going. Wonderful. So, on our way. <laughs> <laughs> Graphics, man. Have you guys the TV show? What? Are they fine? Wait, are they still doing it? Yeah, I imagine so. He's gonna get to the first. Balin or the same ship? Same time. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's a nice little bit. No, no, that'll be Balin. Friends of yours? Nope. No. <laughs> Slowly get away. Yeah, yeah. Quick, turn around! Contact thrown. Kill Sabine Ray and then Ezra Bridger. Then take your place in the coming empire. You won't help? Your ambition drives you in one direction. My path lies in another. Plus I don't need help. Yeah. One parting lesson, Shin. Impatience for victory will guarantee defeat. That's great. The baby never planned on ever going back. Yes, but whatever power is here is what he wants. That's what he wants, right? He doesn't. If Lord Balin proves capable, he may yet win the day. He's not there for you. <laughs> They're cool looking ships. Haven't seen those since Rebels. No. <laughs> They can actually move when they just can't turn, they just don't very good turn circle, obviously. Yeah. That's where they've got like pop-up little baby. Gunships. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, oh nice. Send <laughs> shing shots. Uh-oh. Oh, nice. Oh, that's my, get my house. Oh, 
Nice. Oh, that's awesome. I'd become a monk while I was working. Yeah, 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 exactly. That's always wearing his clothes. Switch class. <laughs> oh, that was a good block. Oh, you brought your serious game this time, sorry. Right. He was looking a bit, struggling a bit there. Yeah, yeah, he is. She's smiling as a. <laughs> Frying bear, to you. Jesus. <laughs> He's got it. He gave Vader run for his money with his non- Where's she gone? There we go. Whoa! Oh, he oh, 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 oh. here! <laughs> He's gonna do the Vader thing. Just yeah, that'd be awesome. Speak to him out of light. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Amazing. Patience leads to defeat. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Three fights going on! Yeah, yeah, he's, yeah, he's the exact. Oh. <laughs> Round two is you. Oh crap. Yeah, there's reinforcements. Good. 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 He's gone, gone, my friend. Just <clears throat> took your ride. <laughs> I've got other shit to do. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> so get 30 seconds of just great acting, just get <laughs> face expressions, and that was awesome. Red duct tape. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and the way he's just standing here watching. Floyd it. teams one and two use constant seven and tandem. Outside is short one nursery. Where's Ben and Scott? Yeah, Take on Ahsoka, come on now. Yeah. Patience will lead to defeat. Well, they're all back together. I hope I survived long enough to see the outcome. <laughs> first match with Tano a success. With our enemy distracted, the cargo transfer is now almost complete, which means we shall soon leave this forsaken place. Time is very much on our side now, and I shall keep it that way. <laughs> I'm just going to throw wave after wave of my own men at them. Lost and confused, isn't she? Yes, right. Soka. I thought you were dead. 
I miss this reunion. <laughs> She was dead. Clearly I was wrong. Guys, getting the feeling. I think I might be going home after all. We finished now, innit? So we're gonna flick to Balin and see where he went. Oh, god damn. <coughs> we'll have to wait till next week to get the episode. <coughs> 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 Man, that was actually packed. <laughs> How are they going to get home? I'm, uh, I'm really confused. Uh, with on it. his ship, right? Track, track to beam onto his ship. Sneak on. That means they'll lose their. That means they'll lose their cool jello ship. Yeah, but would you rather have your ship and stay there, or lose your ship and go back? You know, that means you've missed all the Anakin fight like tapes. Yeah, but she could grab that box that's got it all in, mm-hmm. right? Take a few bits with her. I don't know. Uh, no, she's got. I best. really love that ship. <laughs> yeah, it's just. <laughs> Uh, can't believe we saw C-3PO at the beginning I did not expect yeah. that out of everything <laughs> like I would, a million years never have guessed he would show up I was just uh, Leia's like alright I better solve this problem <laughs> it's just yeah. yeah how much how and how obvious is that guy trying to be against it for the Empire as well it's like I don't even know if he's for the Empire just incompetent or if he's he was like, how did he get that job like and the fact that he's like I vote for this but so just because I say so it's going to happen it's like you've got Five other people then. Yeah, that surely that whole council's got to vote on this. Yeah, that's, yeah. <laughs> that's going to say pretty, no. I'm pretty sure the guy to your left is. Um, oh, what's his name? It's a trap! It's a trap! So he's going to say, yeah, I'm going to vote to <clears throat> yeah. send military response. Exactly. Yeah. It's just, oh dear. So, right else, yeah. And having and, and having great, and Hayden show up again just, as in, just even in a training video he was great. How much stuff do you reckon they've shot with him since they've had him on set? I mean, why not? I just keep him on. I, I saw uh, there was a behind the scenes feature. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing when the full, because like all Disney Plus shows now, they do like an hour long. I think Mando they do like a, a long behind the scenes sort of special features thing. And they already released some behind the scenes thing of Hayden and um, Dave Filoni and Rosario on mm. set together for that episode five, which looked really cool. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing that when it comes out. Just to see like how like just all the stuff they could have done with him, but, um, but yeah, it's just cool seeing him again in his like Clone Wars outfit, mm. teaching teaching her. Cause she had one of those in Rebels, didn't she? A little yes. Hot yeah, I think it was. I yeah. think it was Kanan's, wasn't it? I don't think it was her. I can't remember. I'm watching it so long. Ezra was watching it. Yes, because uh, in season two they meet Ahsoka. Yes, and she gives it to him because it's she's he's teaching. Um, this is all the basic like moves, yeah, yeah, like, like that. Yeah. Yes, yeah, it's <clears> all the basic moves, sure. Yeah, <laughs> so cool, <laughs> so so cool. And Ezra does what he's like, so back as well. Like, I gave it to you. Don't worry about it. Uh, the force will be by. Uh, like, <laughs> yeah. like, it literally just like Dungeons and Dragons style. He's had a class. He's changed his class while he's been away on the planet. Yeah, yeah he's just force, force, yeah, martial just arts. Like, <laughs> that's as well cool. I still think the most intriguing thing is what, why is ba- what's Bailey not doing? Yeah, no, yeah, 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 me too. Yeah. What is out there calling to him, and why is he so obsessed with it? He literally, because he's literally like, you go. Right, His I'm, plan was to go there, whatever it is, never come yeah. back. Yeah. Become one with it, mm. learn from it, absorb it. I don't. I was it. What, what is it? Exactly. <laughs> it's same to the point where he said to uh, his apprentice, "Oh, you know, you go off and become." Yeah, go 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 join Thrawn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. some other something you, else. Yeah. You, 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 you want to be part of this empire? You go. I'm, that's not what I'm here for. This is so I'm so curious. And there's only one episode left as well. I kind of feel like we should have had like another ten minutes with him just finding out where he's gone. Like I say, it's going to be really frustrating if they were going to do a side spin off with yeah, him yeah. explaining no, no, they can't. Yeah, 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 yeah. Agreed. But then again, like we said at the start, if they can do some form of animators tie into yeah. Yeah. tie up. Yeah, definitely. It'd be nice if they said that they were going to do a tie and it was always going to be CGI mm. cartoon style, and they and he's already voiced it. Yeah. Mm. That'd be awesome if that has happened. But it's probably unlikely. But yeah, what I mean, I guess we'll see it in the, next, the final episode of what his what he's done. I lo- and I love Lars playing It's part of me thinks it has to be something force related. Mm. Yeah. That's why you can sense it, right? But what makes him more powerful, become one with it better. I don't even know if he wants does he want to be more powerful? He, he wants to break the chain of like the good, the battle between light and dark, right? He wants to break the. the he wants to say he wants to break the circle. 
Well, it's even, even it. into politics as well, because he said like, it was the, the Empire, the Republic, yeah. some other empires. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's always some other army wanting to take, yeah, he take was, over. Does he just want peace in the universe? But by killing everyone. It's just... <laughs> well, it could be, he wants to just end it. He doesn't want to live in that cycle. Yeah. And no one's been able to beat him in hand-to-hand -hand combat. No. So he's just decided to go somewhere and die, so, I don't know. No, yeah, it's curious. Very curious. So I hope, I hope we get we get that <coughs> fulfilled, because you say, if, if they don't fulfil it in the final episode, it's just going to be a cliffhanger that they can never get rid of. Yeah. So really <coughs> the problem is, it's not like they could have gone, they filmed it all, he died, and they go, oh, well, we can't continue it, we'll have to reshoot yeah, 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 no, Cut yeah. these bits out, because that's yeah. his whole story. Yeah, yeah, no, exactly. And he's quite integral to the, to the yeah, fighting Ahsoka and stuff as well, isn't he? So. Oh, dear. I get, I get the feeling that's going to be the cliffhanger, is that they're going to, they're going to walk back to the home galaxy with whatever they've cargo they've got. Yeah. Sabine and the crew are going to go with them, and it'll, the the cliffhanger will be Balin on yeah. this planet finding, finding some whatever some it is, temple or whatever mm. it is. Yeah, I agree. I think that is going to happen as well. Be like, oh, the like, Thrawn's arrived, and then it'll pan back to him, mm. do where he's done, then it'll end. You know yeah. It and it could have been resolved because obviously it's going to be a movie tying all these together. Yeah. Because yeah. it was explained yeah. in that. Maybe yeah. Yeah, it's going to be hard to try and work. Yeah. Unless they just recast his character for that. It'd be uh, hard, but... Yeah. Be such a good character. He really is, yeah. It's just, he hasn't said a lot, and his mystery, his past is a mystery, yet we like him more than most other characters mm. in the show. It's just, it's just a moment <laughs> after like, she, she went, she, after they fought, and she went off. He didn't even talk like for ten seconds, just, he just his emotion of mm. like... It reminded me a bit of when Anakin yeah. got mm. beaten by Ahsoka, and then he sort of transformed back from yeah. Yeah. Sith to normal. It just gave so they just, he just pond, 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 pondering pondering what to do and he was just like it's like he was could do that could do this um, he, no, he was amused it. by being shot down by this the ship yeah. and her escaping then he saw her go off to help her apprentice and he was like maybe I should go and help my apprentice and he turned around and walked off yeah because he's still he's more like no I'm, committed to his goal yeah no I'm finally here <laughs> it's kind of like a big sort of sigh of relief it looked mm. a little bit from him like now I can go and do what yeah. I wanted to do it's also because she's Ahsoka was in the way when he was like I'm going to have to take you out and then she was like no he's off to go and Save our apprentice. Yeah. Now I've got no obstacles. I can just go where I need to. Yeah. 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 No, very true. So I kind of thought when she landed, I thought he would have like, actually like tried to maybe talk to her, but he just instantly went. I thought he might tell <coughs> tell us and her. Yeah, yeah. What what, what, what is, is there? Yeah. I, did, I did as well. I don't need to fight you because I'm going to go and blah blah blah. Yeah, because he's not working for like um, Morgan anymore. So it's like, yeah. why do I need to kill you? Yeah. You've been like, can you not sense what's here? Can you like help me or something? Kind of maybe, but mm. he didn't do that, which is interesting. I did love Thrawn just sit, stay, like observing the battle and stuff as well, like from like doing it's his quite tactician. That he saw tactical brilliance. He saw Balin as a piece he could move on his chessboard. Yes, and he wasn't there. He was like, "Well, we need to reassess the tactics." <laughs> it's just yeah. like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Very interesting. You know, you never really see that, in, especially in Star Wars, of like the actual quite like the little grid thing that they had as well. Mm -hmm. little, and even then, he was just like, "Oh, it's a massive loss," and it's just like, "I don't think so." <laughs> Literally, it's actually a, a win. I think anything to get at this point, because he's been in that galaxy for so long, not doing anything, and he wants to get back to home galaxy. Anything that gets him closer to getting the hell out of there, I can throw as win. much as I can at it just to get me home. So it's curious to see what all that cargo. Because it's not like he. Because like he's like, oh, we're nearly full. We could leave now. He wants mm. all of it. Yeah. So what is it that's so important that he wants to take back with him? Because he's like, when he's showed the thing of them all there, and the little bars like nearly finished. If you're like. They're here. We'd hurry up. And be like, well, leave the last five percent. We'll just take what we got. But he seems to want all of it for some reason. So it's obviously important enough to risk, like Ahsoka, um, Sabine, and um, Ezra coming coming after the ship. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> it's just it's just so good. Oh, do you think I missed this reunion? And Sabine's like, well, you told me to. Sacrifice him for the greater good. Yes, yes, but I was wrong. It's fine. Everything's good. <laughs> so, uh, I do love the relationship between Ahsoka and um. Oh, for fuck's sake, David Tennant's droid. Oh yeah. <laughs> are we doing hey, this again? Are we? <laughs> yeah. Hey, what's his name? David Tennant. You know, no, no, no. Is it the, the droid? Um, hey, Yang. Hey, Hu Yang, Hu Yang, Hu Yang, yeah, yeah, it's great. It's great. I don't have to learn. Oh, not again. Again, <laughs> after the last time. Well, I, I felt bad about it. Did you really? It's like, 
Yeah. Uh, it's like that, they've all been, um, all been united. Hope I live long enough to see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I live long enough to see it. <laughs> I'd love to meet the person that programmed the AI in that universe because it's also got a sarcasm sub yeah. team. Yes. Well, especially like it's, him being too. Well, it's like, like um, Chopper and it's like, just a droid. A motherfucker coming into it. He's about to really have I really wanted the yeah. arms come up. Like, yeah. Yeah. He, was about to leap, <laughs> yeah. he was about to leap over the counter and stab yeah. someone. Yeah. And he's just like, yeah. 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 Racist motherfucker. Droidist. Yeah, uh, it was good. <laughs> it was. It was a really sort of, again, really cool little episode. Mm. It's funny how you said, oh, I hope they don't go to Coruscant. First thing they do. And they do. And, and it's, it's really actually cool. a really good yeah, movie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, to be fair, to be fair, I was like, if you had, if you had to go, that's the way to do it. Yeah. Mm. Being a C-3PO and then... Brit- and, and Brit- a cool Brit- moment. It didn't last very long, so it was good. Yeah. It was all good. Like, well, sort of between here and on Mothma and Leia, they can kind of put enough ships to the jump point mm-hmm. to intercept anything that's going to come back. Yes. Um, well, yes, yeah, he's got the worst to so. say. I do love the way that that guy as well is like, what about that, that big attack on, on Mandalore? He's like, uh, Moff Gideon was not a part of a bigger <laughs> thing. It's like, yeah. you serious? Like, really? Okay. I, I saw you wearing your own Moff Gideon t shirt this morning before you came to work. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Wearing his empire. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jesus. It's so, it makes it so obvious. But yeah, no, I mean. That's the thing, like, I'd, I'd like to think it wasn't. It's so obvious he's a member of the Empire, it's just that he's. More cautious than the others. Cautious, or, or just, just I'm in a position of power yeah. now. Maha, I'm going to yeah. do whatever I want to to yeah. get money and not really work. Just be a standard politician. Yeah, he doesn't. <laughs> what, he doesn't want. He doesn't want to believe Thrawn's coming back because otherwise it brings him into another war, right? When they're yeah. in peace at the moment. Oh, I've got to, I've got to do some work. Yeah. yeah, exactly. I don't think he, he wants. He's in denial about it. So. Mm. Hmm. Interesting. Very, very cool. Ah, oh, man, I can't wait the last episode next week. Mm-hmm. It's gone so fast. All right. Well, so it's a freaking awesome one. So everyone knows episode 7 of Ahsoka. Please let us know your thoughts below. Did you enjoy it? What was your favourite moment? Are you happy they're back? What do you think is in those boxes? And what do you think and what are you hoping for for the season finale of Ahsoka? Please comment below let us know. If you want to watch the full reaction of this, go over to our Patreon. You can support us there. We'll have the full reaction of this, the rest of this series, and all the other shows we react to. We're also on um, social media. Links in the description below for that. And we'll also do a podcast. So we can listen to a podcast. Type in Legend Podcast. You can find us there. And we'll see you very soon for another reaction.